this is the door that I'm working with. It's quite hard. If you have a pasta machine, your life would be easier. You can roll it much faster. Trying to roll it around three millimeters thick. That is a good thickness to work with. Now, since I'm cutting only one spoon that's remaining in my tray, I'm just thinning it down in the center. Take the spoon and with a sharp knife. make sure the stem of the spoon is a bit thick because this is not quite like steel so it's going to be a bit fragile i have broken a few just grease your spoon a little and place this I'm taking a fork and poking them everywhere. Making sure air has a way of escaping from all the places in the spoon. There you go. Now I can just place it in the tray that I'm going to bake it in. there you go this needs baking for around 20 to 25 minutes depending on the profile of your oven so you will have to experiment a little bit once they are half baked you see they release because you have greased the spoons just release the spoons and flip them over this way so that the underside can be baked as well can you see it's a bit unbaked here be careful not to burn yourself because everything is at 200 degrees here can cause serious burns so work with a pair of tongs preferably insulated one distribute them evenly again and then put them for another 15 minutes of baking or so here's one of the pieces that went bad of the edible spoon that i was making it's just made from salt Atta, sugar uh, and water there so you can eat with it and then you can eat it simple these are the home baked edible spoons and they're quite nice and firm see can you hear the noise nice and brown they're sort of like breadsticks they absolutely look like wooden spoons here's the edible spoon that i've made i'm putting it in hot milk let's see how long it lasts okay Right now it is still hard. There we are. We start now. It's half a minute now. I can still feel the hardness of the spoon. It doesn't seem to have softened very much. Softened, yes, but not very much. It's still holding on pretty well.
it's over one minute now it still seems to be pretty hard and this is boiling hot milk one and a half minutes yep still hard not bad Two minutes gone. Still not disintegrated. Two and a half minutes are up now. Nope, it's still not breaking. Yeah, now it finally crumbled. That was the part which was open. Yeah, the closed bit is still nice and firm. It's almost three minutes now. And there we are. I think they are fairly good if you don't keep them dipped in boiling hot liquids like soup and milk. You can use them for normal party consumption.